In this video, we're going to take 5 eighths minus 3 eighths. So we want to figure out what that is when we do that subtraction there. The thing is, when we're working with fractions, when we subtract fractions, or when we add fractions, we need to get a common denominator. And we already have a common denominator. That's 8. So we're set there. We don't have to do anything. If we have a common denominator, we just take 5 minus 3. That gives us 2. Then we bring the 8 across, so we keep the denominator the same. 2 eighths, that is the answer to 5 eighths minus 3 eighths, but we could simplify it. 2 goes into 2 one time, and 2 goes into 8 four times. So we could also say that 2 eighths, that's an equivalent fraction for 1 fourth, and we simplified it down to lowest terms. So in answer to our question 5 eighths minus 3 eighths, that equals 2 eighths, and you could call it 1 fourth. It's probably a better answer there for you. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.